Dudleys, my name is Lovella K, and welcome back to Duck Jam version 2, aka new and improved Duck Jam. The developers of the game have since put out an update from the last time that I played it, and it's been added with a lot of new goodies, some repolishing of some of the old games, and just from listening to the music, I'm pretty sure they updated the music too, or I just forgot how freaking dope this beat was. Either way, I'm super excited to play this game, so if you guys are excited as I am to see what new things they've added, make sure to drop a like down below and subscribe to my channel for some more awesome content just like this, and if you want to play this fun game yourself, I will put a link in the description of where you can find it on itch.io. So, without further ado, let's go ahead and get into Duck Jam. So the first one is- oh! <laughs> oh my god, that Japanese duck. Oh, they have a little money thing over- ah! It's like Space Invaders now! Instead of it just being black, they added stars in the background and- Oh, and they have controls. That's really, really cool. They have the buttons you need to do to play the game. Which I really like, because before you kind of had to figure it out. So it's nice that they added that in, and they probably won't have that in the hard or- Let's do homework together. You smell like my mom. <laughs> you smell like my mom! <laughs> Cut red. Oh, they made it difficult. They did the brain trick where you see it's blue, but it actually says red, and you have to say what it says rather than what the color is, or vice versa. That's clever. That makes it more difficult because you can't just look at the color and be like, oh, recognition, I know what that is. And that's also a little more friendly to people who are colorblind that might be playing the game. So people who have a disability are now more inclus included? inclusive included as well, which I think is a nice touch. All right, here we go. Let's Pokemon Mystery Dungeon this. I got this! Come on, little ducker friend! Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. I'm not gonna hit anything. I'm gonna YOLO. You guys are gonna be so amazed at my skills. You're gonna be like, wow, lovely. Nope. <laughs> wow, lovely, you're so amazing. <laughs> God damn it. Of course, when I first try and say, oh yeah, I'm gonna do so flippin' amazing. You guys are gonna be so impressed with me. <laughs> you know, oh, so great, amazing. You, you're not even gonna know. I die. Oh, all right. Let's try that for round two because that was terrible and I refuse to accept that as my reality. Oh, um, here we go. Okay. Was there a different way that I could have taken? Let's try up this time rather than down. Maybe down is not the right solution. All right. Uh. What the hell? How come I can hit that like really tall side one several times but I can't hit the other one to go up it. That seems like that's not supposed to be right because it shouldn't be an immediate death as soon as I accidentally touch something a little bit. If I get stuck on something, sure, but not for as soon as I touch it. <sighs> All right, well. I was telling you guys how I was gonna make this super, super flippin' easy, and I'm lying to all of you, so maybe I just have to get good and I'm just being a complaining, whiny little baby. But we're about to find out if that's the truth or not. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, thank God. Okay, so that's probably just a glitched part of the game. Because I could hit the other things, like the one that was very, very vertically tall. So. I'm pretty sure that's just a glitched portion. So the developers, if you're listening, maybe check that part of the waterfall map out. Because it shouldn't be that way. All right, come on. Shoo, 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 shoo. You duck, Oh, I couldn't get the other baby duck to go away. But we have 800 bills. Oh, it's like a goose hunt. Oh, they slowed the geese down. That's nice. Or maybe just for this part because it's difficult and not impossible. My little can can girls. Let's go. I rescued a kitten today. I ate your cat. Force a kiss. Scratch your belly. <laughs> Force the kiss. Oh crap! That was a new game, and I freaking screwed that up real bad. Oh, this is kind of fun. What is this? I don't even. I don't even know. Okay, what am I stomping on? 
Am I just trying to hit all of these things? This is really, really cool. Oh, there's lava though. What do I do? Oh crap, it's like a Mario Maker now. Oh, this is really, really neat. You can either hit the things or the... Oh crap. Come on, come on. Come on, I need to touch your head. Oh, this is such a cool mini game, guys. You have no idea. Oh, this is so cool! And I died. Oh, that was so fun, though! I love that little mini game. Okay, 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 okay. I got you! I got you! Come here! Go go away! Go away, little little ducky deuce. I know the trick to the waterfall one this time. Oh, I got ran over. I wasn't even paying attention. I know the trick to the waterfall one, so I can make that happen without losing any lives. That's not an issue. The lava one I had never seen before, and that was very, very fun. Oh! Heck yes! I still love the little money that comes up. How did I fail that? I didn't topple over! Alright, whatever. Waterfall? Yep. So, I wonder if they changed all the levels, so instead of having it all be waterfalls this time, it is now waterfall, lava, let's see, water, so they're just missing something, earth, so maybe something with digging, if we're going elemental here. I might be thinking too hard into it. But I hope that that means the impossible round is going to be changed as well. Alright, we know the trick here, guys. This is easy peasy, lemon squeezy. We ain't gonna lose any lives here today. Because we are duck jam pros on this channel. And we know what we're doing. AKA the tricks of the trade. Boom, boom, boom. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Get that egg and let's go. Skiddly diddly do. Alright. So we have three lives now. We were granted an extra one by the duck gods. Gray. Oh, they added a wire this time. I didn't even notice that before since it kind of blended into the background. Yes! Oh my god, I love the new Duck Jam freaking color. That's amazing. All the different- Ah! I just love that one. I love the way that they reskinned it. The polish that they did on this game is nice. Offer bread in her mouth. I'm actually a celebrity in disguise. I tattooed you on my chest. Ah! So I should not have, uh offered the bread to her mouth. Oh, I lost. Hmm. Eat! Yay! <laughs> Alright, here we go. Alright, so falling down is easy. It's getting back up that's gonna be the hard part. Ooh, that's interesting. I wonder if there is you get anything for stomping them on the way down, or if it's just kind of to teach you, hey, these things give you a little bounce. Kind of as a, like a teachy lesson sort of thing. Ooh, two of them there. I like that. I like that. Wow, that was like a combo breaker type of deal. Hey, 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 hey. Hey! Oh, come on. There we go. Yes! Hey! <laughs> that is such a cool photo! Oh my god, that has to be the thumbnail. That's just gonna be the thumbnail. Oh my gosh. Guys, Plucky Duck creators, you are so flippin' awesome. But how did I lose a life there? I should not have lost a life there, nor should I have lost a life there. Ugh. Cut blue. Boop. Oh, and you added a white one this time. I like it. Boom! I like it. That was so cool. I hope that means that there is... Oh, this is my... The new one I don't like. Yay! Oh, thank God. Be something I can do. Who am I finding? Oh, I found him. Okay. Blast. What am I blasting? Oh! Oh, well this is super new. Oh! 
Oh, no, 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 no. You best get out of my way. You... This is so neat. Come on, it's like a, that Atari game that came out forever and ever and ever ago. Come on. Oh. Oh, this is so neat. Does that mean there's gonna be like a mega, mega bus dock? Giga Goose! Yes! Giga Goose, come here! Come here! Come here! Oh, this is so, so cool! Giga Goose! He's getting rid of all of the toy blocks. What is my health like? If I get hit, am I just dead? Come on, Giga Goose! No! Oh, thank god I have one more life. I thought that meant I was like, dead, 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 dead. Okay, you little Giga Goose minions. I'm gonna destroy you. This is a game about ducks, not geese. You need to accept that reality. Oh. Alright. Come here, you. Where's my Giga Goose? I was promised a Giga Goose! Huh, that's actually a good little narrow passway, passageway that I might be able to use. Oh, there you are. Giga Goose! Alright, come here. I also love the art style that they use for Giga Goose. The way they drew him is really neat. Okay, so my bullets can destroy his bullets, and that's what the purple um, cloud is. Gotcha. Go, 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 go. Alright, come on. Go, 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 go. Okay, come on. Whoa, the screen's shaking. Is crazy. Okay, get away, get away, get away, get away, get away. Go, 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 go. Shoot, 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 shoot. We got this! We got this! Oh, there it is! The egg! The golden egg! Ah! We did it, guys! And we have 1,700 bills. Hey! I refuse to only have the okay end. Y'all know that here on our lovely channel. We don't strive for bad. We don't strive for even just O oh, flippin' K. We strive for phenomenal, quacktastic even. What do you mean? I found you. I found you! <laughs> so why were you crying? I don't understand this. Alright, well, there we are. In order to get the Quacktastic end, if they haven't changed it, it was you had to have at least two lives when you ended the game. Your outfit would look better on me. You need this. You look great in your uniform. I really, really like the dating sim. They made the options much easier to go through, and it seems like I can read the entire thing now, so maybe they changed the size of the words in the five seconds, which is really, really nice, because it's fun to read all of the obviously wrong options. <laughs> How to flirt with a girl, 101. From Alexa. Let me give you some dating advice. Don't tell them that their breath smells. Don't tell them that they look terrible. Uh, don't tell them that you just killed and hit a body in the back of your trunk. Uh, none of those are gonna get you very far, unless you know that they're a psychopathic murderer with a low sense of self-esteem who enjoys being... You know, give in jibs for terrible things about themselves because they're uh, sadistic that way or masochistic. But you can't assume that from every single person you meet, so it's best to just be kind. Being kind will always garner you more things in life than being rude or being passive or just being downright mean. Just be nice, guys. Like, there's nothing that hard about it. And I messed that one up. I went up way too early. And that's okay. Because we're gonna do it again. There was a game that I was thinking about playing. Um, it's called... Oh god, I can't remember what it's called. It, it just reminds me of Smooth Criminal. I know that is not the name. That's actually the name of a song. However, it, it looks like that. And it's one where it's live action. Some guy calls himself a dating guru. And he put a game together giving all of his love advice. And I saw Jack and Jay from the Cup Scouts play it. And oh my god, is it cringy AF. 
it's so cringy. It's like, no, that's not what you say to get a girl to like you. And the options, the obviously wrong options in the situation, are so flippin' funny. And they act out every single one. So, I almost want to play it just to see how they act out the bad options. Um, and also to make fun of how none of the things that are the good options would actually happen the way that they intend. So I might do that, I I'm not sure. If that's something you guys would be interested in, let me know. I might bring that to the channel, because that just seems like a cringy good time. Alright, come on. Yes! Okay, thank god. Now, I have zero lives, so this really did not end the way I wanted it to. However, we have one life, and if I don't mess everything up here, then we can get two lives, and that just means I have to be perfect, which we all know isn't gonna happen, and just failed, so. Alright, well, let's just fail, because obviously, I need to do that again. Alright guys, I'm back. I just did the, um, easy level. Aww. And I didn't die, so I had four lives, but I completely messed up Space Invader Duck, unfortunately. Duck Invader. Oh, okay, I'm getting the feel of that one, so instead of slamming your- ah! So I love that game. I was hoping I would see that one again. Instead of slamming the buttons when you're trying to balance, you're supposed to just lightly, lightly tap them, so the fact that they're pressure sensitive is very, very interesting. And now we get to do my lava one. This has to be my favorite. This lava one is so cool. It also reminds me of Pokemon Mystery Dungeon, but that's that's inevitable. This, this kind of art style is lending itself heavily to the pixelated art of Pokemon Mystery Dungeon, so that's something that can't be helped. Yay! And that's not a bad thing. It's an amazing game. If you guys have not played Pokemon Mystery Dungeon yourself, oh my gosh, it's for the Nintendo DS. It came out forever and a day ago. However, it is such a good game. Oh man, I died there. I could not find something to stomp on. I would love to bring that to the channel. I really would. I would love to bring DS games in general to the channel. I know that they have emulators that you can play and, and use. And I think I'll do that to maybe start out with like a Pokemon series and then bring Professor Layton and other neat stuff. But I have so many things on the channel right now. Like I need to finish Devil May Cry. I need to um, finish Hustle Cats for our visual novel adventure. So maybe, maybe not yet, but soon. I, I definitely, I definitely want to, to have that be a thing. Bing, bing. Come on, B. No. Oh, I didn't actually need to stop on any of them. I can barely make it. Ah! I flippin' love that we just ran out of the volcano with the egg. That art style is mwah, perfect. Mwah, mwah. I give it, I give it a 10 out of 5. That's how good it is. It is two times as good as the maximum. Oh, come on. There it is. Wait, wait, there it is! Ooh, okay, that one actually got my heart going a little bit there. Topple, 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 topple! Come, come on, fuck it, come on! Come on! Ooh, all those wonderful things. Yes! Okay. I'm gonna kill you. Well, I love the, <laughs> the very Asian, um, the kind of influence that these mini games have. Yay! Oh, thank god that was my last one. Now we get to fight Giga Goose with three lives. Alright, we can do this, guys. I believe in us. Giga Goose! Ba -ba 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 -ba. Come on, Giga Goose, Giga Goose it up. Alright, you little goosey goose. I don't want to deal with you, Goose Goose. I want to deal with your big boss. Where's your big boss, baby? And not like that weird movie. Come on, Goosey Goo, where you, where you be? The music here, though, is adorable, and I really, really like it. Giga Goose! Oh, Giga Goose spawned in a different location than he usually does. That's interesting. How many lives does it take to kill you, Giga Goose? How many shots? No! That means... 
means we have to do it this time. Okay, that was just a bad spot for us to be in. It really was. That was a bad spot for us to be in. Alright, come here. Come on. Boom. Thank goodness. We can do it. If he spawns in the top left again, hopefully we can make that happen. Come on. Come on. Alright. Yes! Top left. Giga Goose! Come here, Giga Goose. No, 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 no. You aren't getting me, you son of a gun. Come here, come here, come here, come here. I can just click my mouse more than you can! No! I ran right into that one. I should have been dodging. I gotta be more defensive. That's how we're, we're gonna win this one, is we gotta be defensive while offensive. We gotta be defensive. We gotta be offensive on the defensive. But the defensive has gotta be our main. Otherwise, we are not getting getting it through this one. These gooky seagoos are not a problem. It's the Giga Goose Man. The Giga Goose Man is who I need. Alright, come here, you. Come on! Yes! Top left! Giga Goose! Giga Goose! Come here, you! Let's end this now! No, 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 no! I need to be defensive, Alexa. What did we just talk about? What did we just talk about, Alexa? We talked about defensive! We talked about defensive! Uh, I have too much pride to quit right now. I need to at least practice trying to destroy Giga Goose, even if I know it means I'm not getting a practastic end this time, and I'm sorry about that, guys. But we need to practice. I need to fight Giga Goose. And we... What happens if I touch Giga Goose? Like, if he doesn't... I'm not gonna win this one anyway. But what happens if I just go up and touch him? Do I automatically die, or do I need to be hit by one of his bullets? That's my question. Alright, let's find out. Let's find out together. Let's not get hit by his bullets, but instead, touch his, his crazy, awesomely large, muscular body. Aww. Alright, well, I couldn't touch his amazingly muscular body, but I'll be right back when we're at that minigame. Egg! Oh, that was a new one! Oh, that was a new one, and I almost screwed it up by typing in WGG. What the hell, Alexa? Oh, I have to type duck this time. Oh, and I got a picture of a ducky! Oh, I wonder what the impossible version of that is. Force a kiss, I rescued a kitten today. Definitely rescued a kitten today. That makes me sound like an American hero. Well, that was easy. My cursor was already on top of the duck. I like it. See, my only question for this level would be why are there ducks in fire trash cans? That's my only question. It is now time for Giga Goose, my friends. Come here, you. I like. Uh. No! Frick you. How dare you. Have, you know what? A thought just came across my head. Have I been thinking about this game wrong the entire time? Is it not the amount of lives you have, but the amount of money you have at the end of the game that gets you the bad, okay, or quacktastic ending? Rather than the bad ending, the good ending versus the quacktastic ending? Is it lives, money, or a combination of the two? Giga Goose! Alright, come here, you Giga Goose. I'm about to destroy you and your family! Well, I already destroyed your family. AKA your minions. Come on, come on, come on, come on. You're not gonna get me! Oh my god, the explosions on the screen make it hard to see what's going on. And that's okay. It adds to the action. I really like that. It's just, oh my gosh, it's crazy. It makes you feel like it's a really big deal. Oh my god, I killed Giga Goose? Why was that so much easier than before? We have three lives and 1900 bales. Please be quacktastic. Oh, come on, please drop the beat. 
Drop it. Yes! Oh my god, I freaking love it! Amazing! Oh. Oh, this is the best, best duck fan, hands down. Hands down, best duck fan! Oh my god. I need to learn to play the drums to this song because, Jesus Christ, this is an amazing rock song. I wonder if the developers wrote this themselves or if they had somebody do it for them. Are you guys also musicians? Or did you find this song as like a royalty-free thing? Either way, it's amazing to whoever the artists are. And I really don't want to stop the music, so <laughs> I'm going to end this fantastic flippin' episode here. Thank you guys so much for coming on this journey again with me. If you enjoyed all the new and improved updates that they did to Duck Jam and want to play it yourself, the link to the game is going to be in the description below. Please go show the developers some love, support, and play their game. Let them know how they did. Rate them on itch.io. Let them know what's up. They really want feedback and to hear your guys' experience. So, Without taking up any more else time, make sure that you've liked this video and have subscribed to my channel for more amazing content, and I will let you guys go. Goodbye, my lovelies. Three, two, one, go!